Happy Halloween, everybody. I'm the Trailbox Gamer. I'm sure in today's episode we're going to be done with the mansion. If we're not going to be done with it in this episode, we'll be leaving it in the next. It's just, I like, I know where to go and I know what to do. It's just at this point, like, I don't know what ways to tackle it. So let's see. We have the shield key so we could get that one mask from the other room. And we already have, like, the poison stuff for the other room, so we're good. Tip, honestly, I know I said I haven't been collecting shit in the rooms, but I think I've... <laughs> I think I decided to do that until a certain point. It's still at that point where I'm still... Oh, fuck! Oh, God, it came back to life. Ah! Oh. <sighs> I should have burned that fucker when I had the chance. I don't have to worry about that fucker. I blew his head off. Clean off. Was this the only door that this key was used for? I, I don't recall. Well, the door... The mask is pretty simple. It's just in the back of the goddamn room. We just have to grab it. And we're out. Fucker gave me a... Oh, fuck that! Oh, God, I hate... I fucking hate giant snakes. <laughs> Where the fuck did you come from? Do they have a cage for you or some shit? Um, a little trivia about this fight. If you were to get attacked, you're gonna need to go and get serum for Chris using Rebecca. Now, imagine the conversation about this fight. Oh, and you could... Entirely skippy, you don't have to fight the fucker. It's like, how did you, how did experiment Y-12 get out? Oh, oh, I let him out. You let out our snake? How did it even get that fucking big? I, I fed it some things, y you know, around the lab. It was hungry, it was smiling at me, I had to do something, it was being nice, I, I had to be nice back. Okay, number one. I hate to tell you this, but... Why dash whatever I said was not smiling at you. It was yawning. That's why we nickname it the yawn. Number two, it wasn't doing that to be friendly. It was doing that because it was trying to attack you. It yawns when it's going to attack. It didn't see you as a friend. It saw you as prey. Do you understand? Oh, I'm sad now. I'm sad too. The zombies. Okay. The zombies. Everyone could handle zombies. This dumbass, though not effective at it, could handle the goddamn zombies. But a giant fucking snake. Do you know how much research we got into dealing with the animals? And it got to this abomination? Now we're going to have to go back. Months of research. Because we're probably going to have to kill it. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry too. I don't know why they even fucking hired you. Like, honestly, the fact that you have yet to be fired is baffling to me. I know, you think they fire me out, like, sooner or later, but they haven't. Maybe that's because you know where all the fucking keys are! You bastard. You absolute bastard. Real talk, though, I hate the fucking giant snake. I really fucking hate the giant snake. First time around it, I can't tell you how many times it killed me. The very first attempt at fighting it, I was going in there. I was considering shotgun shells at the time, so imagine my surprise when I ran into a room armed with nothing but a pistol and a giant fucking snake. Granted, I had a lot of pistol bullets, but that still doesn't, like... Yeah, the pistol does shit, you know? Sometimes the pistol does shit. The pistol's great for the smaller zombies, and any smaller enemy that you come across, but against something that big? Fuck out of here. This guy's still normal. That's good. I want him to stay as normal as he can. I don't want him turning into a crimson head just yet. I'm pretty sure that's the name of the angry zombies. I'm pretty sure that's their name. Ah, then I forgot to deal with you. Look, buddy. 
I really hate to do this because you seem like a nice person. I take that back. You're not nice. You attacked me when my back is turned. You're a bastard. You're an absolute bastard. You know what? I'm just going to ignore you. Fuck you. I mean, if I kill him, I, he's going to turn into one of those angry zombies eventually. Like, I don't think I have any more kerosene to burn these fuckers. So we're just going to ignore his ass. Then, getting to a point, we are going to leave the mansion. I should grab a lot of shit that I don't need. Oh, well, not don't need, but don't want to pick up later. I know, I think it's in this room you get, like, a little... Not this room. This is going back into the main hall. I should have took this way. Why the fuck didn't I take this way? Oh, wait, now I remember. I forgot that this existed. <laughs> I forgot it existed. <laughs> That's why. But I'm picking up this blue... Whatever the fuck it is, gem. It's the Chaos Emerald, Sonic! We just need the green, the red, the yellow... What other ones are there? I kill Those are the only colors coming to mind. But no, this is going to be put into one room and we're going to get shit from it. I think you put it in a tiger statue or some shit. To this way. This room right here. I'm going to be pissed off if I got the wrong room. Like, congratulations, dumbass. Oh, nope, I got the right room. And I keep forgetting that you have to actually use the goddamn item before you can do shit. It gives those shotgun bullets. So, worth the trip. Is there something else I need to do in this room? I feel like I have to put a yellow gemstone somewhere. I know there's a red... I think I'm thinking of a different room. I'm pretty sure I'm thinking of a different room. Ah, uh, look. I'm gonna put my ammo away for now. Because I know that in the upcoming room... There's a lot of shit to grab, a lot of useful shit, and if you don't have, like, you can always backtrack, but you have to admit, backtracking's a bitch. Like, backtracking has got to be the worst bitch. Should I have you heal me? Hey, want me to treat your wounds? Yeah. Yeah, would you? Patch me up. Good, thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks. Somebody sure knows how to get a deal. Most of the medical supplies here are from Umbrella. Umbrella? Don't you know? They're only the biggest taxpayers around here. They make most of these medicines right here. Homegrown in Raccoon City. But there's not much left, so take care of yourself. I'll be fine. I'll be more safe. I'll be excellent. Nothing's gonna attack me ever again. I say, knowing damn well that's a fucking lie. So let's see. Alright, that's good. We can continue now. So let's see. We go into the furthest part of the hall. There's another room. We have not checked in on that room yet. There's also a zombie in that fucking, like, area. We might have to deal with that fucker. I think it's when you leave, though, that you have to deal with him. But, that's not too important. You, you could dodge him easily. Here it is. I would have been so pissed if, the, if I forgot to use a key or if I needed a key with this. Uh. So, in this room, there's a giant plant. And the thing is, you can't get close to the key item without getting slapped. So you need to go to this water filter over here. Turn it on. And make sure you switch it to the red one. Because that will water the giant plant. Making it very happy. But the thing is, we don't want this plant to be happy. 
So we're going to go back here. We're going to use the chemicals. And these chemicals, they're going to fuck it up. Now, you want to get it right for the first one. Because if you don't, well, you see to the right of the plant from my screen? You see those herbs? Yeah, if you get it for the herbs, you destroy a bunch of healing items. And just in case, I'm going to stop it. And I'm telling you, look how many herbs there are. So it's a good thing to get this right, because you get a lot of health from this one area. Especially since we have to come up, like, we're going to be fighting a boss in the next few minutes. It's good to have this, like, prepared, you know? I have never seen so many healing items in one goddamn room in this game. Typically, when I see this, a part of me feels a little anxious. It's like, what the fuck are you going to be throwing at me? But, um... It's not much in this room, it's in the crypt that we have to deal with that shit. And you know what? I'm gonna combine this. You could combine it a total of three times. Yep, that's as much as you can. I think three times gives you full health. Two gets a you a I think two also does a job, but I'm not too sure. And we found the last one, so we're gonna grab it the other one, go back to the crypt, and as you can see I've been Clearing every fucking room, but that wasn't important to show. So I just said, fuck it. And not every room's been completed. Let's see. I think I know there's a healing item in the one at the bottom right, and I'm not sure what's in that hall. Maybe another healing item? Ammo? No. I picked up the ammo. Oh, man, I'm not too sure. I do know that one red area on the bottom right, I think it's where we found our fallen comrade. I know I didn't pick up the herb from that, so with that being said, let's go fight the boss. Alright, we put the mask here. I think it's this one. And then we put the other mask over there. That is not making me feel like... I do not like the look of that coffin. I do not like the look of the coffin. Hi. Please, if you're awake, just stay asleep, okay? Pretend to go back to, go back to sleep, okay? Oh, yeah. That's not good. Hi. Hi! I'm sorry I woke you. I didn't mean to. You are looking very lovely for someone who just got out of bed. Have you done something with your hair? No? I could have pulled- Oh, fuck off! Get off of me! Ah, uh, how did that- Oh. I guess I killed it. Wow! I was expecting a bit of a challenge. Oh, the game gives you shotgun ammo. How nice. <laughs> All that stockpiling for nothing, I guess. Uh, the following inscription is carved into the Denson an eye for an eye, a two for a two. Uh, there's something in here. Grab it. Yeah, sure, why not? An emblem is carved on the opt- opt- bleh. There's nothing unusual. Really? There's nothing unusual? Listen, the last time I didn't examine something fully, I got stuck. Alright? So excuse me if I'm being more observant. Alright, so I collected what I didn't need to collect. The, you know, the supplies, it's just... I realized that by cutting out a lot of the unimportant shit that you don't really need to see because nothing really happened, it's just... I cut a, a lot of time out getting from point A to point B because we've seen this shit before. We know it. And I realized that it cut down my time from 27 minutes. I mean, it's still 20. The doorknob is... I thought I could pass it through three times. I passed it, like, twice. I guess two is the unlucky number. Fuck me, I guess. The thing is, when I originally edit the video and cut out all the unimportant shit... It kind of made it shorter than normal. 
So I thought, you know what would be good? Adding part six. Part six, I get to the next check, like the next save point, and I kind of call it quits there. So I think that would be fine. Also, I can't believe I didn't explore this place. I don't think there's anything in It's locked. Helmet key. Right. I think the only thing in here is like a green herb. For the time being, because, you know, we can't access that one room. So, yeah. If you need a green herb, <laughs> you can find it in this room. No monsters in it, so you'll be good. However, with that other door being locked, that means we have to walk around, and that's going to be a pain in the ass, so I'm just going to skip again. All right, nothing happens. You know, I think I... Oh, right, fuck. This whole... You went down like a bitch. This whole place is, like, swarmed by zombies. I forgot. Oh, fuck me. Damn you, camera angle. You're my worst enemy. I was doing fine until it changed the fucking angle. <sighs> Alright. We're good. Not going through that door because I can't go back. Can I use this on this door? No, you cannot. Why would you? It's it's It needs a key. Not an octagon. I'm going to heal myself with this. Like, I have enough healing items on my ass. I could spare one little morsel of heal. I could heal myself now. I don't need to be so greedy with it. The first time I came here and I heard that there was a dog, I noped out of this room immediately. I have been traumatized by these fucking dog enemies. Let me tell you. I can't count how many times I had these fuckers rip out my throat and instantly kill me. Come on, you little bitch. Ah, oh, you bitch. Fuck you. You dead? You dead? Stay down. Fucking hate these enemies. Okay, yeah, that looks like something... That looks like I could place that one thing into. And again, I can't tell you how many times I keep thinking that you just press it to use an item. I keep making that fucking mistake. It's embarrassing. Uh... And at this point, I think the only time I'm going to skip is if I'm skipping, like, inventory stocking. Because that's boring. Like, have you ever seen someone, like, go through their inventory and spend, like, a minute? Because I think I did a good chunk of that. And I thought, this is boring. Nobody wants, like, no one's going to need to know what I have in my inventory for the time being. Ooh. Is it me or does this chest look important? Does it look important? Like, it looks like you could open it. Is that just me? I mean, there's shotguns over here, but that little tiny wooden chest on the shelf, it looks important. Am I just stupid? Maybe I'm just stupid. I'm not supposed to go here. We need something to get through and I probably should tell you how far I got into the game before everything is new grounds for me it would be getting into hey you know on second thought I'll just announce it when we get past the point that way I don't spoil the game <laughs> that sounds like a good idea you know despite seeing this load like this transition a hundred times already I still like it it's also good for editing because I could just like edit right there and go to the next scene. It's like my own personal transition. Each direction is accompanied by blah blah blah, North Valley of Destruction, South Cave of Hatred, East Summit of Madness, West Path of Revenge. Who fucking named this shit? Yeah, I want to go to the Summit of Madness. I want to go to the Path of Revenge. What the fuck is that? Whisker? Whiskers? Oh, fuck. Dude. I hate to tell you, but we're already there. 
I don't like that. I don't like what he told me. I, I mean, the thing is, we have to go this way. Blue eyes. Chaos of something. Red eyes. The war cry of revenge. So you're going revenge. You're going with madness. But with this puzzle, I think it has to be with what direction they're going. So... Yeah. You have to be going wherever madness was. And you have to go to the path of revenge. Let's see. I can't tell you how long it took me to get this one down. Because you have to time it. You can't just stop it. So red goes, I think, east. Well, I don't remember the gimmick. All I know is that they need to be in a specific direction. You were... Oh, it said destruction. God damn, I'm a dumb... Like, I clicked it too fast, I couldn't read it, but that's... That's past me being a dick yet again. So we go over here. I think I need to read the encryption again just to make sure. Because here's the clue. Alright. North Valley of Destruction, which is Blue Eyes. Cave of Hatred South. East is Summit of Madness, and West is Path of Revenge. Okay. Where does that correlate with the fucking dogs, though? Like, you have to take an account where they are. Not where this is pointing, so what? Do I point to the West? Do I... Fuck it. Because you, you need to have him pointing at that direction. So let's see. You got him pointing in the right direction. I need you to be pointed in the right direction. You are north, I believe. Destruction. There we go. Perfect timing. It's okay, but who the fuck would design it like that? Like, I would have the fucking dogs... Like, I don't know. It just... This is pissing my OCD off a bit, like... They should be facing each other or facing the same direction. So, I mean, I guess they technically are. Fuck these crows. Something I learned the hard way is that if you run by them, they get pissed. If you walk, they're cool. But yeah, fuck the crows. It's just, I don't know, like, I guess... What the fuck is that sound? The, the monster in the woods that Whiskers was telling us about? I really wish you gave me that warning five minutes before I went into the fucking woods, dude. Like, really? Five minutes. A minute. Hell, 30 seconds before I even saw the door. That would have been fine. I mean, regardless, we still have to go this direction, but a little... Uh, a bigger warning would have been better. Not bigger, uh, earlier warning, I'm sorry. Why does this part get me so fucking confused? I can never tra I can never traverse this part easily. It always fucks with me. I don't think there's anything good to collect here anyway, so... Let's see. No, I think we just go in. Yeah, I don't think there's anything to collect. Yeah, there's nothing to collect. We're good. I don't know when I stopped trying to collect everything. I mean, maybe I still try to. It's just... I remember at one point, I just stopped giving a fuck. I think it's more later in the game. I think I was more interested in just beating the fucking game at one point. Oh, that's a nice little fire. Too bad we can't take a nice little brick near it. I mean, even if we could... 
I don't think this is a good place to do so. That lost little cabin. Oh, well, there's shit in here. The lost, the lost cabin in the woods that looks abandoned. You really want to... Wait a minute. This place is supposed to be abandoned. Why is there a fire? Unless it's not abandoned. Oh. Oh, fuck. Um. I'm going to collect the shit I need and get out. We're going to skip that for now because fuck doing that. I mean, it's a, it's like, it takes a minute off, but it's whatever. Yeah, I'll take, I guess I'll take the crank for now. Is that what we came all this way for, a crank? The fuck are we going to use a crank for? Um, I'm going to save and I think that's where I'm going to call it quits for now. I'm definitely calling it quits. I did not like that sound. Well, with that being said, more lore I'm skipping over. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you next time. Have a happy and safe Halloween. Take care.